Welcome to my series on my favorite drugstore makeup. And if you have favorite brands, favorite products that you love from the drugstore, leave me a comment and let me know because I always want to try new things. I love makeup. I am not a makeup artist. I'm not a makeup expert. I'm you. I am just over 50 and I love to look good or, you know, try to look good, right? I love makeup and we all have our favorite brands, our favorite products, but let's face it, sometimes you just run out of something or they, God forbid, quit making something and you have to try something new. Or I'm always like, Worst case scenario, what if I'm out of town, I'm on a trip, and they lose my luggage, and I need to go to the first available place, probably the drugstore, to replenish some of my favorite things, right? What am I going to get? So I'm going to share with you some of my very favorite drugstore products, and we're going to start with eyeliner. Hey, how are you today? I'm so glad that you're here. I'm Dawn from Just Doing My Best, and I'm here every week with a brand new video for women over 40 and women over 50 who just want to look and feel our very best. And if you enjoy this video today and you have fun with me, I hope you'll come over and find me on Facebook or Instagram at Just Doing My Best, and we will have a lot of fun over there. I'm always showing fashion and makeup and all kinds of just day-to-day -day crazy stuff. You never know what you're going to find. But today, we're gonna to talk about drugstore makeup. If you're like me, you probably have your favorite brands. I have a lot of favorite brands and favorite products, but I always am trying to find new things at the drugstore, things that are just really easily accessible, but also super, super budget friendly. You never know when that's gonna come in handy, right? So I'm gonna share with you my favorite new eyeliner, and then I'm gonna share later my next favorite, I guess my most um, easily accessible backup. So the first thing that I wanna share with you is my new favorite eyeliner is by Milani, and it's the Stay Put Eyeliner. And I will leave you a link so that you can find this. And I love, I love this eyeliner, and I wanna tell you what's the, the very first thing that I look for in an eyeliner. One of the first things that I look for in an eyeliner is I like an eyeliner that twists up. I don't like to sharpen an eyeliner. Maybe it's just me. I just feel like every time I sharpen an eyeliner, I am just losing product and I'm losing money. So I don't like to have an eyeliner that I have to sharpen, but this Milani Stay Put Eyeliner does come with a little um, sharpener at the end. If you want to use that, you can, but I'm gonna show you how I apply this and you'll see I don't need it to be super sharp anyway. So I can just, when I twist this up, I'm getting everything I need and I can just put it on and then I'm smudging it in anyway. So this works just fine for me. So that's the first thing I look for when I go to look for an eyeliner is I want something that I can twist up versus having to sharpen it in order to expose more product. That drives me bananas. Also, when I look for eyeliner, if you've been here and you've watched any of my videos before makeup videos, I don't love black eyeliner. I just feel like the darker the eyeliner is, I feel like it can be super, super harsh. Um, you know, if you're like me, over 50, my skin is getting more pale, I've got more wrinkles, all of the things. And I feel like if my makeup is super, super harsh, it just brings that more into focus, which I don't love. So when I'm looking for an eyeliner, I'm looking for a brown or maybe a dark brown at the, at the darkest, a green, um, I have hazel eyes, so I love um, like a copper or a bronze color. I love a, um, a gray eyeliner, love gray eyeliner. So this Milani Stay Put Eyeliner, I'm using in the color Semi Sweet, and let me show you how I use it. So 
So you saw when I applied this eyeliner, what I did was I usually start in the middle and then when I go over, I kind of do it in like a wedge. So I'm not, I didn't do like a cat eye or anything like that. Instead of just following my lash line Instead of going all the way down, I went out just a little bit. I didn't flip it up. I was just kind of creating like just a little bit of a wedge. I started in the middle, went over and I did my wedge and then I came back and then I usually only go over about two thirds of the way. And then I just kind of really, really smudge from about here on over, just so that I don't have that really strong, really stark line. I wanna say that this Stay Put Milani eyeliner washes off beautifully. Um, I take my cleanser and then I just really just rub that and rinse, 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 rinse. Comes right off with your face soap and water. So I'm just, absolutely loving this and um, I want to share with you my next favorite if you can't get your hands on this one. While I am loving this Milani Stay Put Eyeliner, I, I really love this. This is so nice. It just goes on so well and I will link it in the description below this video. I will also link one of my other favorites that's not a drugstore brand not super, super expensive, but I love it. And I use um, like a bronzy color, love that one. Now, the next one, if you are just, you know what, you can't get your hands on the Milani Stay Put Eyeliner, you're not near a Walgreens. If you're near an Ulta, one of my other favorites, also a twist up, is the Ulta brand, the Ulta Beauty Automatic Eyeliner. I love this. I do wanna say, I feel like the Milani Stay Put Eyeliner stays true all day long. Goes on beautifully, it washes beautifully. I mean, I'm telling you, this really gives my other favorite one a run for the money. But this Ulta Beauty liner, very nice, comes in a ton of different colors. It's also a twist up um, and it just washes off beautifully. It may not always stay as true as I would like it, but it doesn't like completely fade off or rub off or anything like that. I just don't find it to be as true at eight o'clock at night as it was eight o'clock in the morning but it's not like, oh my gosh, where's my makeup? Do you know what I mean? So don't worry about that. But the Ulta Beauty um, automatic liner, so many different colors, and this is under 10 bucks. The one that I have here is called Metallic Moss, so it's a green color. And then this one is called Charcoal Glitter. Don't let the name fool you. It's not like, whoa, super sparkly. It's not like that. It just means it's not a flat color. So I love both of these. So if you're in Ulta and you wanna try these out, absolutely try out um, some of their colors for their line. I really, really like these and they're just a really good backup. You know, sometimes I like to layer. So I might use something like a dark brown and then layer a green from the from mid line over and then blend it in. So you know what, if nothing else, it'd be great to have these as a backup. So I'm gonna link all of these in the description of this video. I would love to know what some of your favorite drugstore brands are, what some of your favorite products are, and if you have a favorite eyeliner, please let me know, especially if it's automatic, because you know those are my favorite. So I can't wait to see you next time for the next video. If you enjoyed this and you had fun here with me, definitely like this video, share it with your friends and subscribe. Go out today and be blessed and do your best.